what's up guys what's good my name is bro Banya. yes ghana is positive blog and i welcome you to our youtube channel christian vibes tv charlie christianity is never boring so it's your first time watching or joining this channel make sure you subscribe so you didn't miss our daily dosage of christian entertainment new strengths happening right here in our gospel industry so uh charlie here's a video of our very own petticoats chairman sons uh samuel Yamiche, yes uh, and stephanie their traditional wedding and their white wedding so watch and make sure you subscribe after watching my name is brabo and stay tuned for more updates At this point, I want to hand over to Apostle Kumi Labi. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God is good. And all the time, uh, God is good. Once again, I want to give thanks to God for his special grace and his mercies that has brought us this far. Beloved in the Lord, as we read from Revelation 19, what we are seeing today is a shadow of a foretaste of what will happen on that great day, the, the day that we all have in view. So as I humbly invite our brother Samuel Ansonya Mitchell to be on his feet and Sister Stephanie Ousia Ajimai Amwakon, I want us to sing Dum Dan the Marana Obeye. As they gorgeously take a few bold steps to the middle, as you look at them, then let's begin thinking about what will happen on that day that the church be adorned with a white linen without any spots or wakening. But the groom standing on the other side waiting to receive the church. Dum Dan the Marana Obeye. Dem dan, dem ara no be ye. Dan, dem ara no be. and sisters in the Lord, we are gathered in the presence of God and this congregation to witness the union of this man, Samuel Ansun Nyameche, and this woman, Stephanie Owusia Ajima Amwako, standing before you in holy matrimony. Marriage is an honorable estate, 
and divine and of divine origin and institution. It is sanctioned or approved of in the Holy Scriptures and dignified and forever hallowed. For our Lord was present at the marriage at Cana in Galilee, where he performed his first miracle. It speaks to us of the mystical union of Christ and his church. The Holy Scripture says, marriage shall be honored by all. So, we must conclude that it must not be regarded in a light manner. And as taken and entered into in all solemnity, with wisdom and forethought, reverently in the fear of God, with the understanding that it was first ordained for the mutual help, fellowship, and comfort that the one ought to have for the other in prosperity and adversity, for the honorable procreation of children and for their training in love and obedience to the Lord. Into this holy bond of these two persons are now willing to enter. Therefore, if anyone knows of any just cause, why Samuel and Sunyamich and Stephanie Ousua Ajima Marakon may not be lawfully joined in marriage, let him or her now speak, or else forever hold his or her peace. We've raised the marriage bounds a couple of weeks back. And if you have something, this is your last chance. Otherwise, we support them with prayer, counseling, and encouragement. If they aren't anything, let the church shout a big amen to that. I didn't hear that. Amen. I humbly ask who gives this woman to be married to this man. I'm going to please take a few steps forward. Now, humbly and respectfully ask that you hold your daughter's right hand and place her hand into the gentleman's right hand. I'm going to ask, thank you very much. God bless you. Now, Samuel, uh, the lady came veiled. So now I want to give you the opportunity to unveil her to let us know whether it's indeed Stephanie we all gathered yesterday to go and pay something for. Kindly unveil her so that if it is her, we can proceed. Otherwise, Apostle Samarco is not far from here. We can just talk to him. Let there be light shed among us. Let there be light. Stephanie, thank you very much. Now, Samuel and Stephanie, I require and charge you both as you will answer at the day of judgment when the secrets of all hearts are made known. That if either of you knows of any lawful impediments why you may not be joined in marriage, you shall confess it now. Samuel, I'm Sonia Mitchell. If you have nothing, then 
repeat this after me. I do solemnly and faithfully declare. I do solemnly and faithfully declare. I think your voice should be louder than mine. <laughs> I do solemnly and faithfully declare. I do solemnly and faithfully that declare. Is it. That I do not know. That I do not know. Of any lawful impediment. Any lawful impediment. Why I. Why I, Samuel Kojo Ansong Nyameche. May not be joined. May not be joined. In holy matrimony. In holy matrimony. To. To Stephanie Ama Oswa Ajiman Amwakon. Amen. Amen. Stephanie, please say this after me. I do solemnly and faithfully declare. I do solemnly and faithfully declare. That I do not know. That I do not know. Of any lawful impediment. Of any lawful impediment. Why I. Why I, Stephanie Amo Uswa Ajemai Amwakon. May not be joined. May